Hey YouTube, it's Jonathan, and I'm here with a what's in my bag that was requested slash I told you I would do it, and this is the bag in question, my coach, bleaker, something or another. I really should have looked that up before filming this. I'll put the name of it right here. <laughs> Alright, let us do the thing. Firstly, as you can see, I have a pair of sunglasses just chilling out on the outside, because I'm lazy and can't be bothered to go in my bag to find them. These are a pair of yellow sunglasses that I bought from a vintage shop in downtown Fredericksburg, Virginia called Horseshoes and Hand Grenades. They are just a yellow matte see-through frame with a gray lens. Um, yeah, not much else to say. I love them. If we open up the first pocket, there is a lot of things. Um, my phone, my wallet, my car keys, yes I drive a Volkswagen, no it's not a bug, iPhone headphones, I actually like these a lot, I um, with the iPhone 4 like I always had to bring my own headphones because they never stayed in my ears, but the iPhone 5 headphones definitely way better. Charger for the iPhone. And I've got some icebreakers. I've got the Fruit Punch and the Wintergreen. Um, and the first zip I have in here just the script for the show that I'm currently working on. Yes, I am playing Flat Stanley in the musical adventures of Flat Stanley. Uh, yeah. That's that. I'm going to skip the main compartment and come back to that and just do that last to get that all together. Um, in the this zip here, I usually keep whatever book I'm currently reading right now. I'm not reading a book. Well, I guess this is kind of a book. This is The Life Remembering Audrey 20 Years Later. Um, and this is all like photos and like blurbs about her. It's kind of a book, but it's, you know, a picture book for adults. Um, I have a problem and an obsession with Audrey Hepburn. You can probably see her feet right here. Um, there's a picture of her up there, one over there, four over there, one over there, a calendar of her over there, ooh, two up there. In the back pocket, I just have, um, my current work schedule and a cursive J that I drew. That, um, pocket, by the way, has a snap, like, magnetic closure, um, as well as the main pocket, which we are going into now. The first big thing I see in here is another pair of sunglasses. These are marked by Marc Jacobs in their case. They look like this. They're just kind of burgundy. I think I might take these out because they are a little folly, um... With this color, that's why I picked up those yellow ones the other day. Yeah. I have this little yellow Coach Zip um, pencil case. I bought this initially because I thought, like on the website, it looked like it was like this big. And I was going to be able to keep um, like my makeup essentials in it. Um, that, obviously, I didn't read the like measurements on it because clearly on the like website, it's like 3 inches by 9 or whatever this is. Um... So I use it for its original intent, which is just for some pens and a highlighter. I need these at rehearsal all the time, at work, you know, people need pens. I have a fragrance lurking around in the bottom. This is the Beckham, David Beckham Signature. This is a good everyday masculine, but not like gross, really manly smelling. I don't know. It's just kind of fresh, but light and good smelling. Descriptive. Good and delicious are the only words I know how to describe fragrances, so you can go on the website for Beckham fragrances and just read about it. More mints. These are the Starbucks Peppermint After Coffee Mints. Um, these are awesome. They're so, like, potent. Um, the first time I got these, they expire. No, January 2015. The first time I got these, I put two in my mouth. Bad choice. Burns. One is enough on these mints. They're potent. I've got a mini lint roller that I have not opened yet. 
That didn't work. I wear black at work. This is great. Um, I just bought a new one. It was a dollar. Um, yeah. Good for when you wear black and have a dog. I have a tiny user in skin calling daily moisturizing cream. This is good stuff. Um, hands, arms, wherever you need it. Good life. I have an EOS, this is the pomegranate, whatever it's called, what is there to say about lip balm? I've got a lip balm. Advil, this is like the original Advil bottle, but now it's just the, um, the blue Advil, the Advil liquid gels. This is the thing I need all the time when you work in retail, people get your headaches because they crazy. Um, lots of times, sometimes I, um, have like back pain because I do theater and I'm dancing a lot and this comes in handy for that as well. I also have a um, an Ulta oil-free sunscreen stick broad, spe broad spectrum SPF 50. Um, I have visible tattoos and I just kind of like to, you know, put this on them, you know, if I'm driving or walking out and there's like sun, you know, protect them and stuff. Um, but yeah, that's why this is in here. There's a hair product in here. This is the Sexy Hair, um, Big Sexy Hair Powder Play. I love this. I have one in my bag. I've got one in my travel bag. I've got one in my drawer. I just bought a new one yesterday and it's sitting on my desk. I have too many of these, but it was on sale, so I needed it. Right? Right? Whatever. Big hair is hot hair, the higher the hair, the closer to heaven. I've got an umbrella in here. It's from Calvin Klein. You can read that on here. Uh, you know, it's just a black umbrella. I'm pretty sure it was like a, like, gift with purchase at some point in my life. Um, but it's like the pushy down one, so I keep it in my bag. And in here I have my little makeup pouch. This is the, the Bungalow 360 little flippy thing. I'm going to go through this very last because I know it's what you're all waiting for and I'm going to make you wait for it just another minute. In here there's just one more zippy. I have in here like packets of things. I've got two of the little um, Tide stain thingies. I don't know. You kind of squeeze them and then like the white part gets wet with like stain remover. Um, I need these all the time. This used to have four and you can see where they're now. I've got an Aleve pouch in here. This I got from Birchbox. It's the Niche for Men deodorizing wipe just in case, you know, in life, you know, I get trapped somewhere and have to not shower. And another little sample I got from Birchbox. This is the Urban Essentials Eucalyptus. Did I say Essentials? Urban Essentials Eucalyptus Towelette. Um, another kind of I feel gross, need to clean myself thing that I have in here just in case. And then I just have this, oh, a memory card and a bunch of change, probably like th five, lots of dollars. Oh, that's a lot of quarters change. Alright, in my little makeup bag, um, it flips up, it's got like a handle, I think this is technically like a little wristlet clutch thing, but it fits my makeup in it. If I unzip this, I'm just gonna grab a handful. These are all like the things that, um, if I have like a makeup meltdown emergency, I need to start over, or just kind of need to touch up, or want to change up my look, kind of everything in here. Um, uh, Anastasia Rubber the Hills Brow Wiz, Ash Blonde, you know I should stop talking about this product, but it's simple, easy, small, fits in here. The Maybelline number 10, this is the Fit Me Concealer, under eyes, all over the face, great if I just have like a random zit or like, ew, I hate that word, um, you know, redness or something that just needs to be concealed that's in there. Um, if I want to change up my look, I've got the, wow, oh, all the writing is gone, Smashbox Always Sharp Liner in Sumatra. Um, great to just add a little bit to the tight line or all in the eye or 
just to change up the look. It's kind of a nice thing to have. I have in here an old Anastasia brow gel and espresso, um, just to kind of add to my lashes or to set my brows if I want to darken them halfway through the day, um, or my, you know, eyes are dissipating, because that happens a lot. In here, I also have an e.l.f. Complexion Perfection Powder. This is mostly because it has a huge mirror in it. Um, this is just kind of a swirl these together translucent, makes you're supposed to look better. I don't know if it does that. It mattifies the skin. And it's got a huge mirror in it um, that I need sometimes. For cheeks in here, this is the tiniest blush that I own, so I keep it in here. This is Bali from Cargo. It's just a nice, everyday kind of pink, um, neutral, but not too brown, not too pink. Perfect kind of just goes with anything color. To apply that or the powder, I also keep in a little pouch inside here with a little zipper. Um, just the Smashbox Mini Fan Brush. I have a couple of these that I like to keep in here with my regular makeup just to kind of do the thing with. And because I'm an addict, I have three lip products. The first is the Bare Minerals Loud and Clear Berry Remix. This is just a sheer berry kind of gloss stick, I guess. Um, as you can see here, it doesn't really give much color. It kind of just adds a hint of, um, berryness to the lips, and it's really moisturizing. Also from Bare Minerals is the Marvelous Moxie in Party Starter. This is currently my favorite lip product. I'm a little bit obsessed with it. It's Problem. I will swatch this for you as well. It's just a coral um, gloss. I put it on really sheer because I am a boy and I don't really want, like, you know, a bold lip, but there it is sheared out. And lastly is the Tanya Burr Eye Candy um, Champagne Toast. This one is just a neutral kind of caramel colored gloss with a little bit of glitter to it. Um, and that is just there. Well, that was everything in my bag. Don't forget to check out my latest video that it will be linked right here. That is a giveaway that I've got going on. That closes on April the 3rd, so don't forget to watch that and make sure you get your chance to win the product. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Check out my Instagram and Twitter. Both are at John John Talks. My new blog, which is Jonathan Curtis on yt.blogspot.com. And I will see you next time. Bye. It's bronze, metallic, it's nice, it's classy. This brush is fabulous. Um, yeah, it's just beautiful. It opens like this. The product is just kind of striped in there. I don't even have hair. Is this yours? Probably. <laughs>